And breaking news, police say they have arrested a suspected serial killer. The victims, all women, died decades ago. Welcome to Coin 6 News at 6 o'clock. I'm Jeff Giudola. Jennifer is off tonight. 55-year-old Homer Lee Jackson now charged with 12 counts of aggravated murder, three counts each in the deaths of four different women between 1983 and 1987. Tim Becker, just back from the police station. He has more from the newsroom. How did they crack this cold case, Tim? Well, cold case detectives have been working to solve the murders now for more than 10 years. They tell me there is a sense of satisfaction among them today, but there may also be more victims. The four victims they know about right now, Essie Jackson, Tanya Harry, Angela Anderson, and Latangi Watts were all strangled. All their bodies were found dumped around North and Northeast Portland. One thing they had in common, they were all involved in prostitution. Because the investigation is still ongoing and detectives think there could be more victims, they wouldn't share anything specific information-wise on how they finally did crack the case. It's a combination of both forensic evidence and other investigative information. Much of the information was obtained by the original case detectives. Uh, much of the information was in such a fashion uh, that it actually simplified our work once we got a couple of breaks in the case. And I'm not going to be at liberty to discuss exactly what those breaks were. Well, we did some checking, and Homer Lee Jackson does have a criminal history, including a felony conviction. Detectives are asking anyone who might have experienced violence at the hands of Homer Jackson or who may have associated with him in the past few years to step forward and share their stories with police. Jeff?